Hi, it's Anya again. Um, doing another review. This time I'm reviewing another nude cosmetics product, the Facial Lifting Mask. Um, comes in a box like this. That's what the box looks like. You know. Oh, upside down. <laughs> But Nude Cosmetics Facial Lifting Mask with Secret Ingredients. I really like the packaging. It's similar to the other Nude Cosmetics um, lip gloss that I reviewed. It has flowers and, you know, it's very, very modern. I would say it's more for older, the older people. I'm 19 years old, but, you know, I would say it's for 18 and up. I, I, you know, it's definitely for a more mature audience. I don't think children would need a facial lifting mask anyway. But, yeah, you take it out and... Comes in a container like this. It's about right to my hands, about this big, that much around. Um, it's a nice packaging. It seems really special. And then it comes with a um, like a pad to use. So what I do so far, I've been using it for three days. I've used it um, morning and night, which I think is a little much. I'm gonna start using it um, two or three times a week. I don't need a mask every day, but. Yeah, so I take it out and it, it kind of, it's grayish colored, kind of like the color of clay. If you can see that. I smelled it. It doesn't really smell like anything. It just, it kind of smells like sunscreen a little bit, but it feels, smells like a natural thing. It doesn't seem like it's bombarded with scents and um, unsafe products, which would not be good for my face. Since I'm, I'm still kind of a teenager going through the phases of, you know, acne, I still break out occasionally and I don't want a product that makes it worse. I want a product that clears my face, you know. So I used it, so I basically just, just go like this, get some on here and spread it around after I wet my face. So I wet my face first, then I get here and spread it around and I leave it on for 10 minutes. Then I rinse it off and... Well, I noticed when I first put it on, it felt like lotion. It felt like moisturizer, like I was moisturizing my face. And then I just rub it in and let it sit, and it, like, kind of disappears. And then when I wash my face, it's almost like I'm not washing anything off. It seems like it just sinks into my skin. And I noticed that it felt... Usually I have to put um, moisturizer on. Like, you're supposed to put moisturizer on after you wash your face. But with this product, it's like... I don't really even really need moisturizer. My face is like so soft. I just, I used it a couple hours ago and like my face isn't oily or anything yet, you know. It seems like it's completely protected. I just love touching my face with this product. <laughs> um, yeah, and I, it's only 16,000 won. Like in America, like cheap stuff would be $30, $25 for something like this. It's only about... 16,000 won I would attribute to about 15,000 or 15 American dollars and that's nothing that's a really good price I would definitely buy this product again because it leaves my face moisturized and seems like it's a really good product and it's not expensive at all so as for rating it on a scale of 1 to 5 I would give it about a 4 just because um, I want to buy stuff that actually has a really big effect on, on me. Like, I don't feel like this has had that much, too much of an effect. Like, my face is smooth, but I didn't really have problems to begin with, so it's not that much of a difference. But if I had really, um, if I really had problems with my face and I used this and it made, like, my face soft and more dramatically changed, I would definitely give it a five. But just, just because of who I am, I don't think I need it as much. I would give it about a four. But I really, really like it, and I would definitely buy this product. And I could see Americans definitely buying this product as well. If it, if it goes overseas to America, like people will buy this because it's inexpensive and it's nice. Thanks. Bye, guys.